greater love had no man than this, but a man laid down his life for his friend. My sermon today is entitled, No Greater Love. What did I say, church? No Greater Love! As I look at the great examples of love throughout the ages, there is a list of notable references. Romeo and Juliet, Cleopatra and Mark Antony, Napoleon and Josephine. The list goes on and on, and the more so, quotes of love that will cause anyone here to blush. But so shocking, there is no mention of the one story that I know to be the greatest. That one story where a father gave his only son to die. Tell us! To die in agonizing, cruel death. To say you, 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 and yes, you, and even me. What a love that is. Nothing else can even come close. Because I have lots of love in my heart for Jesus. Because I have lots of love in my heart for you. My appeal to you today is that we focus on the great sacrifice made for us. Mm-hmm. And in turn, we should love one another with a new love, with a true love. Let us look to what the Father did for us. Think of self less, think of others more. Let us love, and let our love be a genuine love. Amen. We have heard it said time and time again that life is too short. Mm-hmm. But today I tell you, church, that time is too short. Too short because Jesus is soon to come. Yes. Can I get an Hello. amen to you? Amen. 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 